Greetings, welcome back to Matters of the Heart Radio Ministry broadcast today <clears throat> here on 99.1 FM Jams on your radio dial. We're celebrating Matters of the Heart Radio Ministry 18th anniversary. So if, uh, if uh, to the best of my knowledge, we have someone on the line right now that uh, wants to call in and can congratulate Radio host personality, Princess Denise. Who do we have on the line? Hi, this is your sister, Connie. Happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. Thank you, my beloved sister. <laughs> Thank you so very much. Did you call You're in welcome. to sing a song or what? I'm just kidding with you, Connie. <laughs> <laughs> God bless you. God bless you. Well, I'm sitting here in the studio today with my uh, daughter, uh, uh, Kiwa, and uh, my daughter, uh, Riss, is not here right now. So, uh, Kiwa, would you like to greet your aunt? Hello. Oh, please Hello. now. Please now. No more, my dear stuff. Thank you. <laughs> Hello, Auntie Connie. How are you today? I'm fine, <laughs> Kila. I'm glad to see you and hear you and see that you're there and support and as you always are. So uh, I really appreciate that and admire that about you. Thank you so much. I appreciate the compliments mm -hmm. and thank you for calling mm -hmm. in. Oh, you're welcome. My pleasure. And Miss Connie, did you have you have any other comments you want to make we you know we giving you extra time so go right ahead anything else on your mind in your spirit no i just want to encourage everyone who's listening that the ministries that you took that you do on a weekly basis are needed everywhere every city every community every denomination we should all be reaching out especially in uh consideration of how things have been restructured in the wake of COVID. There are a lot of people who are homebound, a lot of people who are sick and needy, and uh, that little extra touch of reaching out to them, involving them, gives us one of the things that God planned, reaching out to show love for one another. And he said, if you uh, love me, feed my sheep. So reaching out to feed the word or whatever encouragement can be done is sort of like a, a prescription for love for the community. Well, thank you so much, Mrs. Constance, Pastor Mrs. Constance Portier. Praise God whom from whom all blessings flow for the work you're doing as well for kingdom building. And what a blessing it is to hear your voice today. I'm so glad you were able to get through timely. And what a blessing it is, Connie. So you have a blessed day in the Lord. I'm going to go ahead and try to make room for see if a few more people can come through. And I just want to let you know, Mrs. Portier, I love you to life. In the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Be blessed. All righty. Bless too. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> all righty. We thank God for um, all the calls that are coming in one by one. Again, for those that are listening out there in Radio Land, the number to call in is 727-637-2416 if you'd like to call in. In the name of Jesus. Amen. We got a call on the air. Caller, you on the air. Who's on the line? Hello, hello, hello. Hello. Is this sounds like my grandson, Jeffrey? It is. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was just calling to wish you the happiest um, 18th anniversary, and I do really wish you many more to come. Well, thank you. What you're doing, what you're doing is amazing. We all love it. We all love you, and we also love your ministry. Okay, how much did someone pay you today? <laughs> <laughs> that was anointed, Jeffrey. That was a mm -hmm. blessing. That was Of course, of course. <laughs> that was very sweet. 
and I am so glad my little grandson got uh, was able to come call back and get in and uh, and and uh, do this congratulatory comment for his grandmother. So mm-hmm. I thank you, Mr. Jeffrey Tyler Parker. Okay. You're welcome. You're welcome. All righty. Talk with you later. Chat soon. All right. Be blessed. Okay. Bye bye. You too. All righty. All righty. So absolutely. Let me see where I was. Uh, every time someone calls through, I forget where I was. <laughs> so, with that being said, um, we thank you. Uh, I thank all the callers that are, have called in thus far, one by one. We know the whole world cannot call in <laughs> uh, on this uh, hour, this uh, one hour program today. But I'm so thankful for the ones that are able to get through. And that's a good thing because they're coming one by one, just showing love and uh, and just really rejoicing with me because I'm giving all the honor and praise and glory to the Lord. If it would not been for the Lord God Almighty on my side, I wouldn't be here right now. So I thank God for the, them calling in just to share kind, loving words. I certainly would... I, I certainly uh, thank every one of you that are calling in, and I think we have someone on the line right now. So, caller, you're on the air. Hello? Hello? Okay. I'm sorry, I can't hear, hear it too clearly. Okay. Yeah, this, this is Pastor Darrell Dave's calling for the matters of the heart. Yes. How you doing? I'm doing good. <laughs> Yeah. Well, praise God in your comment today. Mm-hmm. Um, Pastor Davis, um, this is Donald Jackson, station manager. Would you mind turning down your radio in the background? because it's kind of, And don't listen to the radio. Listen to her on the phone, okay? Okay. All right, because then there is a delay, and it will confuse you. So if you turn it down and just listen to your headpiece on your phone, you'll hear very well, okay? Okay. Thank you, Thank sir. you. Good. All right. This is Pastor Davis. Yeah, Daryl Davis. Oh, oh, my Lord. Good eve- afternoon, Pastor Daryl Davis. Oh, my goodness. What a blessing it is to hear your voice. Yeah. Uh, yeah blessing to hear your voice. <laughs> <laughs> well, praise God. I am so yeah. glad you called in. I haven't talked to you in, I think, two years now or maybe three but what a blessing it is. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is a blessing. It is a blessing. And, and that is why we're here in the studio today celebrating Matters of the Heart 18th anniversary. Uh, <clears throat> that's when I started radio 18 years ago. And two years before that, I became the pastor that God had called me to be in 2002. So it is a blessing that you've taken this time out today just to call and and can congratulate me i really thank you from the inner depths of my heart and soul thank you so very much yeah you're welcome it's my pleasure to do it because you have been an inspiration yes uh, sir yes sir yeah. is all well with you yeah, everything is fine uh, okay all this blessing uh, all right even, even through covid God is blessed. Okay. And I think about you all the time and what you have done and what you have sacrificed. Yes. For, for people. And I pray God blessing upon you. And may God bless you too, man of God. Hope to talk with you soon. Be blessed. God bless you. Bye. Amen. Thank you. <laughs> all righty. All righty. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. We are truly streaming on Facebook uh, under Denise Parker Wright (laughs) on Facebook. So if you're on Facebook right now listening, go right over there. We're live streaming. Yes, we are. Amen. 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 Yes, yes, yes. Let's welcome my sister Cheryl who has entered the studio. Good afternoon, everybody. Yes, yeah. Hey. <laughs> I hear a little uh, phone. It's not hanging. Oh, okay. Hold on just a moment. All right, we got that. Oh, Cheryl Parker. 
Smith, what a blessing it is that you are, have arrived. Blessing <laughs> it is. <laughs> well, uh, uh, before we get another call, uh, Donald, uh, Donald let us know. But what you want to start off saying about the Matters of the Heart ministry has been doing for the last 18 years, to the best of your knowledge. First of all, I just want to uh, give honor to God for being here, making it possible for me to be here, but also making it possible to give you the strength to move the needle in the community. Everything that you do that touches, basically affects people's lives uh, entirely from their emotional, physical, and spiritual uh their physical being. Uh, the Matters of the Heart Ministry obviously helps people deal with their emotions. You also do a prayer line seven days a week that help, gives people spiritual food, as well as you help feed the needy through your uh, through your unselfish giving, through your uh, uh, your Christmas drives and your Thanksgiving drives. I mean, you just move the needle in the community so much. It goes to show that that if you have the will, God will make the way. And uh, you have shown that through all your many, many efforts. I mean, we're so, so thankful to have you a part of our family. And I know the community is extremely gracious for all your unselfish giving throughout the 18, year, 18 years. All right. Thank it's you. It's amazing. Amazing. And, I want to just give sad. you a, 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 a clap. I mean, it's just fantastic. Oh, my goodness. Praise the Lord. <laughs> oh, Lord, they both here. Oh, my God. <laughs> well, you know, I know when I started radio in 2004, I don't know which one it was of you all, whether it was you, Kiwa, or Turiana. It's like, uh, Mom, is you just going on radio just to have another hobby? Was well, Which one said that? Well, you know what? It could have turned into, but I mean, it became your passion. And you, like I said, you have moved the needle. So, I mean, I am so thankful and gracious for your unselfish giving because it takes time, effort, and commitment. I mean, it's, no, it's, not, it's not enough to have a passion, but you, have, you are committed to this. I mean, that's what shows, and that's what's mm -hmm. the amazing part. Mm -hmm. Oh, so was it you that said, is this a hobby? No, that was Toriana. <laughs> <laughs> that was definitely Toriana. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> well, at least now I rem or know who it was. I couldn't remember which one I say. It's got to be between uh, Toriana and Rissa. <laughs> that's Cheryl. <laughs> Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yes, absolutely. <laughs> oh, yeah, you got all the information. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> yes. yes. Okay. Yes, yes. Let me uh, make an announcement again for anyone else that wants to call in before we go off the air today. Okay, radio listeners, uh, if you'd like to call in at this time uh, just to make a a little com uh, congratulations statement for about a minute or so, you're more than welcome to do so. And that number is 727-637-2416, right here on your radio dial. Just call in to 99.1 FM, absolutely, in the name of Jesus. So we're going to just talk about So one thing I want to say is I want to thank my both of my daughters, my son, my grandson, uh, all that have helped me through the years uh, for so many assignments that you all had and you accepted them. Uh, Donna, we have anybody on the line? Yes. All righty. We have another caller on the line. And who's on the line? I'm it is Toriano. Oh, my goodness. Lord, have mercy. What a blessing this is. And you're calling for what reason now? <laughs> oh, I just wanted to get uh, so graduated to my mom and her beautiful radio show for these 18 years. She's been kicking butt, getting out there and getting great guests on there, doing great interviews, doing great work, uh, facing the Lord, you know, and spiritually uh, helping so many people. So I just wanted to put my knowledge out of her, uh, let her know I love her, her grandkids love her, everybody love her. So I just want to let everybody know that. Well, you Thank know. You, thanks. Oh, my goodness. I was just about to say, 
uh, for all these events that I've had for 18 years, uh, the blessings have been on high because of the three children that I have, Cheryl, Toriana, and Kiwa, uh, 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 arriving and supporting and giving and, and doing whatever you could do to make sure it was a successful event. And that's the blessings of God for, for on behalf of all three of you. You were doing the work as well for kingdom building. Yes, you were. So thank you for all that you all have done. Help buying the turkeys, getting gift cards, uh, doing the programs and helping with the food. Everything that your mom asked you to do, you all came forth uh, with all that you had within you to do uh, the work and make sure it was successful. So I am truly blessed, Mr. Toriana Parker, to hear from my one and only son today. And it well, is a so, blessing. We're so grateful to have you in the wonderful work. And Mark, first, you've been as a, a mother to us, a grandmother to our kids, and great grandmother to those kids. It's the wonderful work you've done in the community. You just so much. This day is all yours. We're just so grateful to have God sent you to in our world. And I'm born from you. So I, I'm super happy. Absolutely. Can you gonna say thing to your brother? Thanks for calling in. Oh, you got you got a celebrity on there? Ain't you like, oh you you already on there? Oh, you got a celebrity on there. Uh, I seen that young lady here for breakfast today. All right. Four, down at 1059 on City Second Avenue. All Top. right, all Monday right. Arissa, you yeah, having yeah, a yeah. comment for Jer Toriano? Hey Toriano. Hey, another sister. Hey, you tell your husband we missed him down here for that breakfast we had at ten to the nine. Yeah, Rissa's here. Rissa's in the house. Hey. Yeah, he ain't want to put a little plug in there. You know what I mean? Just a little plug. Yeah. Shout out to Torianos at 1069 62nd Avenue. Need to know where we are on Saturday morning. Exactly. Oh, yeah, yeah. Could we make that announcement? Yeah, oh yeah, so absolutely. Okay, Every well, Saturday morning starting at 9 a.m. Um, let Rissa do it. Okay, Rissa, you go ahead and make the announcement. I am pulling out the, I, I am pulling out the receipt book. <laughs> all right. <laughs> go ahead with your All name. right, all right. So come on out, everybody, to Toriano's Daiquiri's Pizza and More. Oh, really? That's what oh. it's called? <laughs> at 1059. 1069 62nd Avenue South. Uh, that's the place to be every Saturday morning starting at 9 a.m. for a delicious, scrumptious breakfast that you will not regret. Come on out and grits, eggs, bacon, all your favorites. All your favorites. Pancakes. Pancakes, all your favorites. I guarantee you will leave, uh, leave with your stomach full and tight. Oh, you know that's right. <laughs> Tidy righty out of sighty. All righty. All righty. All right, Mr. Parker. Thank you for calling well, thank in. Thank you so much. And thanks to my siblings and mom. Y'all, you're doing a fantastic We love job. you to life. Work. Yes, we do. Yes. Amen. Yes, all right. <laughs> okay, all right. I'll talk to you guys later. All right. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so absolutely. Uh, what time frame are we looking at? How many Five more? Minutes. Huh? Five minutes. Okay, yes. And so, no, seven oh. okay, seven well, we'll see if anyone, uh, one more call or get a chance seven to come. Somebody, somebody on the line? Huh? Mm -hmm. okay. Oh, okay. All right, caller, you on the air. Who do we have on the line? Uh, this is Sister Mary. Hey, good. In. Good afternoon, Sister Mary. Call him. Uh, good afternoon, Princess Denise. I just wanted to call and wish you a happy 18th year anniversary of celebrating 18 years of ministry. Amen. Thank you, Minister Mary, calling all the way from the great city, the state, I'm sorry, of Tennessee. What a blessing. All right, woman of God. It truly, don't bless me. You got through. I told y'all, you have to uh, break your way uh, through the gate and come on. <laughs> and yes, you did. And I prayed before I called, and the Lord blessed and gave me access. So uh. <laughs> happy anniversary. Happy, thank you, uh, Minister Mary. And I'll talk to you later. Be blessed. Okay, thank you. Amen. Bye -bye. Okay, all righty. Thank you. One thing I can say, 
Is everybody uh, obliged obliged by making sure they call every three minutes? <laughs> 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 they sure Donald been handling that phone over there. Oh yeah. So we'll uh, we don't know if we're gonna get one more before we get ready to get off the air. But any words of encouragement from either one of you all that you want to leave with the radio listening audience? We've gave a little information about the ministry. That was good. But anything encouraging in your spirit you want to say to the audience? Because we're closing out in about a, two or three minutes. Well, I want to say uh, to the radio audience, remember, only what you do for Christ will last and be counted. In the end, only what you do for Christ will last. So remember, as you go forth throughout your day, throughout your week, month, years, remember to put God first in all that you set out to do. Amen. Amen. And I just want to say, you know, even more important than talent, commitment is the key. And that's what you have shown all of us a great example of what it looks like when you're committed when you're committed you will move the needle and make a difference and thank you for all the difference that you have made mom princess denise amen amen to that remember commitment commitment that's what it takes that's what it takes i think you have a call on there all right we don't okay well i just want to say what a what a blessing it has been raising these children. What a blessing it has been. Donna, we have somebody on the line? No. Okay, okay. Just want to make sure. You have a call. No, no, no. Just keep going. Okay, so okay. yes. Because um, it takes work to raise children now. I'm telling you. Absolutely. Especially when I remember when I started working at Allstate. Oh, you don't make what you, you make what you make now. Certainly wasn't what you make then back in 1973. You sure did. What can you do with making a dollar forty-five cent an hour? <laughs> but you had to persevere, Rissa. Had to persevere, Kiwa. Sure did, and Amen. do the best you could with what you was working with, because that's what the wage paid was: one dollar and forty-five cent an hour. Well, it was a miracle, and in the Bible, God gave a lot of miracles. He fed a multitude with very little. Yeah. Kiwa, give the scripture. <laughs> well that's good so we're getting ready to uh get ready to close out and we think uh, again i want to thank uh, we got five minutes okay oh i thought you said okay great okay well anyway i want to thank everyone again out there in radio land that's just listening uh to this program today uh matters of the heart radio radio and ministry line <clears throat> ministry and conference line so that's what i i'm so thankful to god because god will order our steps to do what he's called us to do for kingdom building and the first thing he did call me out to do was to uh, minister on radio he said speak to the nation and 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 that followed just what the other part that had to follow um Ever since 2006, I've been so blessed to travel all around different countries, whether it was Poland, Austria, London, England, uh, Amsterdam, Holland, and uh, 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 London, England, and just to go on and on and on. So what the blessing is was that I was able to uh, minister in those countries because every time the pastor would say, we're leaving in a day or two, so who wants to do the ministry before we leave? And that's what I would do, raise my hand. I do, Pastor Hams. I want to give the message. And he would allow me to do so. So that was part of God saying, go forth and speak to the nations. So I spoke local, national, and international around the world. And that's why we're just so blessed because of God's blessings that he's led me to do and to do the work he's called me to do for kingdom building. And before we go off the air, I want to thank the manager of this station, uh, Donald Jackson. I want to thank my video technician, Mr. Al Christopher, for all that he do, because uh, all these years I've been over here at 99.1, it's been a blessing. And I was able to do what still what God had called me to do uh, in Jesus name. And uh, 
I just want to say to all of you out there today, love you to life. If you don't even know me, just knowing that God is blessing you and we're supposed to love one another. No matter what's going on, love one another in Jesus name. So we're ready to we're going to we're going to close out and uh, we'll be back next month on the second Saturday in the month of September. So be be blessed and uh, hope you're in church tomorrow or just listen to a, a, a program on air. Uh, from YouTube or, or be on a prayer line ministry. So in Jesus name, have a blessed day. Amen. Amen.